Hi, I'm Steve from LotPro.com and today I'll be taking a look at the 2013 Hyundai Veloster Turbo. The most striking aspect of the Veloster Turbo is its unique three-door layout. Not only does a single rear passenger side door make ingress and egress easier, the way the door handle blends into the right C-pillar makes it nearly invisible. A particularly nice touch was the matte gray finish on our tester. Despite the fact that it requires special care, the number of compliments you receive while driving it might even justify the additional thousand dollars it adds to the bottom line. The Veloster Turbo is powered by Hyundai's 1.6 liter Gamma dual overhead cam direct injection four cylinder engine. Transmission choices include a standard six-speed manual or optional six-speed automatic. Interior fit and finish, as well as the quality of materials used on the turbo version, is exceptional, with tastefully patterned soft touch surfaces on the dash, as well as upper door trim. There's also a Bluetooth phone system, along with a seven-inch multimedia touch screen. Large interior door pulls, an especially nice touch, make closing even the bigger and heavier driver's door especially easy. The backlit instrument panel gauges are easy to read, while a tilt and telescopic steering wheel, along with the height adjustable driver's seat, make finding a comfortable driving position easy. Leg, head, and hip room up front is fine, even for taller drivers. But the two rear seats, due to the Veloster's low roof line, are hardly adequate for long trips, as even shorter passengers barely clear the lower rear window. While there was no noticeable body lean in corners, the turbo is only comfortable on smooth surfaces. Bumps and washboard surfaces are more uncomfortable as the suspension seems to transmit every pavement irregularity directly and nearly unfiltered to the vehicle's occupants, amplifying the limitations of its torsion axle rear suspension to the point where it can feel skittish. Both the clutch and the somewhat longest shifter work smoothly, but were overshadowed by the steering system. While it's an improvement over the standard Veloster, Hyundai recalibrated it to make it a bit quicker and it is noticeably heavier, both on-center as well as overall steering feedback could be better. Pricing for the 2013 Veloster Turbo starts at $22,725 and can top out at $29,430 for one with all the trimmings. The Veloster Turbo has a lot going for it. Like the original, it has a great interior. But no matter how nice the overall package looks, the engine and body write a check that the suspension and steering just can't cash. And while I applaud the effort, the overall results just don't live up to expectations. Well, there you have it, the 2013 Hyundai Veloster Turbo. I'm Steve from LaPro.com. Have a great day.